edged tablet. Before the birth of men, the dragons ruled all of Mundus. Their word was the voice, and they spoke only for the ho 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 trunids. For the voice could blot out the sky and flood the land. Okay. Thank you for the advice. The tip. Oh, fuck. God damn it. Let me get some spider. Help! <laughs> yeah, swing and a miss! Yes. Spidey shit. Stupid spider. And I think after I get a little bit more established in the story and they tell me more about the shouts and stuff, I think I'm just gonna start going exploring. Um, what I'd really like to find is the Thieves Guild, but I have no idea where to find that, so I may just search out the biggest city. Will probably probably be my best bet for finding the Thieves Guild, it's just to find a city and snoop around a bit. And above all, I will be avoiding trolls. Oh, look at this guy. Hey, buddy. Keep an eye out for wolves if you're headed up the path to High Hrothgar. Okay. I... I did. Strange days when the monks will do that. I wonder what it means. I like to spend time up here. Walk the steps. Meditate on the emblems. Doesn't hurt when I bag some game along the way. They're not the sort to take visitors. But I never go that high up the path anyway. Some folk who make the trip leave them food or other essentials. But not to make conversation. Alright, All right, cool. Then. Good to know. Good to know, sir. I will keep my eye out for the wolves. Oh, I didn't read the tablet. Men were born and spread over the face of Mundus. The dragons presided over the crawling masses. Men were weak then and had no voice. Okay. That ice wolf. Oh, shit, there's another one. Up you go. Yes! I think that means I won. Come here. Hey, oh. Branch, take bowl, take coins. Read Edge Tablet. The fledgling spirits of men were strong in old times, unafraid to war with dragons in their voices, but the dragons only shouted them down and broke their hearts. Hey, dude, are you not wearing a shirt? Oh, you are wearing armor. Keep an oh. eye out for wolves if you're. What do you want? Leo! How I'm... you doing? Kain called on Parthernax, who pitied man. Together they taught men to use the voice. Then dragon war raged, dragon against tongue. I must be getting close now. I wonder if it's way up on the top or if it's... Oh, what the fuck is that? Tell me that's not an ice troll or something like that. God. Fuck. Well, he's coming this way. Alright, let's do it. Frost troll. Damn. Here, have some Dovahkiin. Yes! Dos! Oh! 
Oh my god! Alright. New plan. Don't fight Ice Troll. Don't fight any trolls until you get way more badass. Oh, let's see if I can sneak by this dude without him noticing me. My sneak is up to level 32. Have I leveled up yet? No. And if all else fails, I'll just Dovahkeen him <laughs> with my with my hurly burly vocal cords. All right, dude, just stay up there. Don't pay me any mind. Goddamn frost! Oh no! No, no. Yeah, run that way. Good. I, I need to read this real quick. Hang on. Man prevailed, shouting out and out of the world. Proving for all that their voice, too, was strong, although their sacrifices were many fold. Ah! He sees me! Run! Oh shit, is this the path? It is. It is still the path. Good. Run! I think. Is this still the path? Whatever. Okay, there's the path. Just run! Is he still coming? Don't care. Run! <laughs> I do not want to fight that ice troll. Okay. I think I, I think I outran him. Let me get my, <laughs> let me catch my breath. With roaring tongues, the Sky Children conquer, founding the first empire with sword and voice, whilst the dragons withdrew from this world. Cool, I guess. What about the uh, the frost trolls? Where do they fit into this tapestry of? Man and dragon. That's probably what the next stone is going to talk about. Meanwhile, I stroll numb on man's head. I think I, I must be almost here. Let's read this one. Jurgen Wincala chose silence and returned the 17 disputants. Wait. And re oh. Jurgen Wincala chose silence and returned. The 17 disputants could not shout him down. Jurgen the Calm built his home on the throat of the world. Aha! Holy cow, this is a long way to go just to, to get up here. Ah, I can't see! Ah! Snow! Let's look out over the it. Oh, I'm gonna say that's it. Just a, just a guess. Whoa! Man. What is that? Is that the ocean? Which way am I looking? I'm looking this way. No, that's land. Unless I'm seeing... I am seeing way out there. So there is the ocean. I still can't zoom out all the way, which is weird. But I can see all the way down to the ocean here, which is cool. And I will go find that ocean eventually. One of the really badass things about these games. If you can see it, you can usually go find it. Except for a little bit of invisible wall syndrome at the edges of the map. For years all silent, the Greybeard spoke one name. Tiber Septim, a stripling then, was summoned to Hrothgar. They blessed and named him Duvakin. Dragonborn. And one more. High Hrothgar discovered. The voice is worship. Follow the inner path. Speak only in true need. What do you mean? Oof! Well, here we are. Search chest empty. Here we go. And what can I steal in this place? Oh, I steal dragon's tongue. Look at that. Maybe they'll let me take stuff after I tell them that I'm 
Dovahkiin. Hello! Dovahkiin, Dovahkiin. So, a dragonborn appears at this moment in the turning of the age. First, let us see if you truly are Dragonborn. Let us taste of your voice. Um, hang on, one second. I think I want to see if there's subtitles. That may help, because the dialogue isn't always it's totally loud. Dialogue, subtitles. Strike us with the power of your voice. Boosh! Dragonborn, it is you. Welcome to High Hrothgar. I am Master Angir. I speak for the Greybeards. Now, tell me, Dragonborn. Why have you come here? Um, <laughs> because there was a loud scary noise in the sky, and that freaked me out. Um... Uh yeah. Um well, we are here to guide you in that pursuit. Just as the Greybeards have sought to guide those of the dragon blood that came before you. You are not the first. There have been many of the dragon blood since Akatosh first bestowed that gift upon mortal kind. Whether you are the only dragonborn of this age. That is not ours to know. You are the only one that has been revealed thus far. Oh. That is all I can say. The plot thickens. Uh. We are the Greybeards, followers of the Way of the Voice. You stand in High Hrothgar, the slopes of Kinarith's sacred mountain. Here we commune with the voice of the sky strive to achieve balance between our inner and outer selves. Okay. We are honored to welcome a dragonborn to High Hrothgar. We will do our best to teach you how to use your gift in fulfillment of your destiny. Sweet. You're gonna teach me all, all your elite strats. That is for you to discover. We can show you the way, but not your destination. Alright. You have shown that you are dragonborn. You have the inborn gift. But do you have the discipline and temperament to follow the path laid out for you? Uh, that remains to be seen. Without training, you have already taken the first steps towards projecting your voice into a thum, a shout. Now let us see if you are willing and able to learn. When you shout, you speak in the language of dragons. Thus, your dragon blood gives you an inborn ability to learn words of power. All shouts are made up of three words of power. As you master each word, your shout will become progressively stronger. Master Einarth will now teach you Ro, the second word in unrelenting force. Oh. Ro means balance. Dragon tongue. Hey, hey! Combine it with Fus. Force. Fus! Focus your thumb more sharply. Wait, he can do it too? I thought I was the only one with this. The others do not speak. Their oh. voices are too powerful for you to withstand. You you will like a monster. You truly do have the gift. But learning a word of power is only the first step. You must unlock its meaning through constant practice in order to use it in a shout. Okay. Well, that is how the rest of us learn shouts. As Dragonborn, you can absorb a slain dragon's life force and knowledge directly. As part of your initiation, Master Einarth will allow you to tap into his understanding of rope. Whoa! Whoa! What's going on? Now, let us see how quickly you can master your new thumb. Okay. What do I have to do? Demonstrate. Use your unrelenting force shout to strike the targets as they appear. 
Oh. <laughs> Sorry. Foos! Use both Foos and Ro. Together they will make the shout more powerful. Hey. Foos! Bro! Aha, you hold the button down. Thanks for telling me that, asshole. Strike the targets. Well done. Again. Okay. So hold the button down. Alright. Now what? I guess that takes longer to recharge. <laughs> the game totally doesn't tell you how to do that. You have to hold the button down. <clears throat> you learn quickly. And then release at the time That's you cool. want, I guess. Is that three? One more? Yeah. What up? What up, dude? Impressive. Yeah. Your thumb is precise. You show great promise, Dragon Ball. Oh. Where are you going? We will perform your next trial in the courtyard. Okay. Follow Master Bori. Master, master this guy, master, master man with, <laughs> with uh, convenient arrow on head. Let's go, master arrow on head man, boy. All right, now what? We will now see how you learn a completely new shout. Master Bori will teach you wood, which means whirlwind. Wood. You must hear the word within yourself before Whoa. you can project it into a thumb. Hey, look at this. Yes. Approach Master Alright, I'm gonna put on um Oh I'm gonna put on general subtitles. Because not only can I barely hear what they I turned the music up is probably part of the problem. So let me put on general subtitles, and then let me turn the music down a little. There. Now we will see how quickly you can master a new shot. Okay. Master Wolfgar will demonstrate whirlwind sprint. Then it will be your turn. Cool. Let's do it. Shouts. Uh, whirlwind sprint. Master oh, Bori. Da -da -da. Come back. <laughs> Wrong button. Um, yeah, favorite that. Okay. <clears throat> Carrying units wake with the speed of a tempest. X. Wolf. Whoa! Your turn. Okay. Stand next to me. Master Bori will open the gate. Use your whirlwind sprint to pass through before it closes. All right. Let's do it. Boom! Yeah. Yeah. What up? Your quick mastery of a new thum is uh, astonishing. I'd heard the stories of the abilities of Dragonborn, but to see it for myself. <clears throat> you were given this gift by the gods for a reason. It is up to you to determine how best to use it. You are now ready for your last trial. Retrieve the horn of Jurgen Windcaller, our founder, from his tomb in the ancient fane of Ostengraf. Remain true to the way of the voice, and you will return. Okay. The way of the voice. Why are the dragons returning? No doubt, the appearance of a dragon born at this time is not an accident. Your destiny is surely bound up with the return of the dragons. You should focus on honing your voice, and soon your path will be made clear. All right. Uh, is there anything there is else? There is indeed much that we know that you do not. That does not mean that you are ready to understand it. Okay. Do not let your easy mastery of the voice tempt you into the arrogance of power. 
That has been the downfall of many Dragonborn before you. Dragons have always been able to shout. Language is intrinsic to their very being. There is no difference in the dragon tongue between debating and fighting. Shouting comes as naturally to a dragon as breathing or speaking. In mythic times, when mortal kind was in great need, the goddess Kinnereth granted us the ability to speak as dragons do. For most people, long years of training are required to learn even the simplest shout. But for you, the dragon speech is in your blood, and you learn it almost without effort. Sky above, voice within. So I have to go through another dungeon, I guess. Ja, open my journal. The Horn of Jurgen Windcaller. The great bird Anya sent me to, on a final trial, retrieve the Horn of Jurgen. Blah, blah, blah. Retrieve the Horn of Jurgen. Okay, right. Where do I have to go for that? I'm assuming it will show up on my map. Oh, way over here? Really? Whoa, <laughs> that's far away, buddy. Um, okay. White run his way down there. I think, um, actually, I, I just want to go exploring. If I have to go all the way over there anyway, then I think it's time to go explore, find some cities. Uh, maybe, um, oh, look at this. Cleared. These are these, uh, the bandits I faced earlier, and it says cleared. That's, that's interesting. No, wait. Fort, oh, Fort Amel was where the mages were, and these are where the towers with the bandits. It says cleared. Maybe... Did I not get everything here? That doesn't say cleared, or... I don't know, maybe that's just a mistake. Let's see what this says. Bleak Falls Barrow, cleared. Cool. Nisa's cabin. Hogan. Walkreath. Where is the big city? I wonder that. I wonder that. Solitude, Morthal, Dawnstar. Alright, so anyway, um, set destination... Let's go to Windhelm for fun. Yes, place Marga. All right. So is this the? This must be the way. Oh, I see. This is the way to their leader up here. And looks like this breath thing is gonna blow me out. Holy shit! No, no, back up! Oh, oh. oh my god! Yeah, no kidding. It's either really cold or, I don't know, something up there is painful. <laughs> so apparently I can't go that way yet. Let's see, let's get the bow out. Put it, oop, put it away. Do a little sprintsy sprints. I wonder if I can jump up. Uh, let's wait for it to uh, recover. Let, maybe it can angle it, or maybe it just goes straight forward. Let's get up here. And this thing. Get up on that. All right. Let's point up. No? Has it not recovered yet? What's going on? Do my feet have to be touching the ground? No, no. You just go straight forward. Oh, well, that's interesting. I wonder if I can hit people with that. And use it as a weapon. And until I've explored a little bit more of the area of Skyrim, I think I'm going to... I think I'm going to avoid using quick travel, at least for the time being. So let's see, where's my marker that I placed? It should be on my... There it is. So I need to go directly that way. I wonder if I can just go down the mountain. Let's try it. Why not? Oh boy. Well, here, here goes. Ah! Oh! <laughs> Whoops! 